Hey guys, this is Tom from Numbers Game Lifestyle. And today we're going to talk about why porn stars suck in bed. Okay, I know it sounds a little odd, but I know a lot of guys, you know, they watch these type of movies, you know, porn movies. And that's the only kind of reference point they have for you know, getting women in bed. Like what happens when they get women in bed? And how to please women, how to be good in bed, as from what they see in porn movies. And man, if that's your reference point of how to be good in bed, you are going to be disappointing a lot of women out there. Okay? That's like watching, you know, WWE wrestling and be like, oh, okay, like that's how you fight? Like, that's how you beat up a guy? Okay, you, you give him some Ric Flair chops, and then you give him the rock bottom and the people's elbow, and that's how you that's how you win a street fight. A real life street fight. That's how you win. Hey, it worked for it worked for the rock, it worked for Stone Cold. It should work for me, right? And that is exactly like you get into a real fight and you're gonna quickly find out. And get your your ass totally kicked and being wondering like why didn't any of these moves work it works so well for stone cold it works so well for the undertaker but it, it's acting and porn is acting it, it's not real you know sex that you want to replicate at home because the women are faking orgasms the women are faking arousal Let's let's examine what happens in a typical porn scene, right? Okay, the guy's hung like a horse, right? Big, big rod, and he's vigorously pounding away on this girl. You know, every orifice, getting turbo speed, and uh, yeah, and she's in theatrics. You know, she's going crazy, going, oh yeah, oh keep going, like, oh. You know, all the usual theatrics. And when you look at her actual body, you know, her her pussy, her vag is as dry as the Sahara Desert. And how do you know this? Easy. Just look at the guy's dink when he pulls it out. It's dry as the Sahara Desert. And while he's like ramrodding her with his donkey dick, like working super hard, you know, working like his life depended on it. Uh, she's there with her hand, you know, on her magic bean, trying to vigorously coax herself to get aroused, to get herself lubed up because his, his big rod or hammering at home isn't doing the job. You know, she's dry. She's not even close to orgasm. She's not even aroused. And for a woman to be, you know, get close to orgasm, she has to be aroused. She has to be wet. That's like... That's like a guy not even being erect. That's how like far she is away from any kind of orgasm. She's not even wet. She's not even close to orgasm. But that's the thing. These movies have nothing to do with the woman's orgasm. They have nothing to do with making it feel good for the guy, making it feel good for the girl. No, it's making the viewer, the person watching the movie, it gets them aroused, right? That's the whole point of a porn scene is to get the person watching aroused not the people having sex aroused not the people actually doing all the work their their arousal their climax is not important it's the guy that's watching you know that's who they're making the video for so when i say like oh porn stars are terrible in bed no they're probably actually very good once they're back at home not on camera because they're actually prioritizing you know each other's orgasms but that's not the priority when they make a porn movie. The porn movie is for you. You know, the guy watching. It's supposed it's supposed to be like a most arousing and exciting for the guy that's watching. So this is why exactly like wrestling, you know, if it was a real fight it'd be less exciting. So they'd put up the theatrics, all these crazy moves, you know, that don't actually work in the real life. And this is exactly like how it works. Like, if you try to copy what you see in porn movies, you're going to be disappointing a ton of women out there. 
because it's not how it actually works in the real world, right? Like in actual porn movies, you know, the, the whole point is like they're in uncomfortable positions, you know, they're th like thrusting real super hard. Like they don't care about each other's orgasms. They don't care about how each other, you know, how close they are to getting aroused or, you know, going over and climaxing. If you follow what you see, you know, and take inspiration from what you see in porn movies, like, oh, that porn star, he really gave it to her good. Look at how she was moaning. Look at how she was like screaming and all this stuff. It's acting. It's acting. You try that same kind of, you know, thrust a million times an hour with your donkey dink and see how well that goes for you, right? It's not going to go well, just so you know. Uh, you're going to be disappointing a lot of women out there. It's not even working for the girls that are in the movie, right? They're in the porn movie. They're like, man, like, uh, this is going to be a long day. I'm not even close to orgasm. I'm not even wet. It's like, how, how enjoyable can that be? You know, the woman's not even wet. She's not even close to orgasm. So do not try to replicate <laughs> being a good lover uh, from what you see in movies. It's exactly like trying to like just be in a street fight, you know, and trying to pull off like stone cold stunners and things like that. You're just going to get your ass kicked. Anyways, that's the video guys. Thanks for watching.